It's a sad day. Okay, so um, actually you have to prepare your hands clean and your face clean. I actually already wash my face. If you don't, I don't really suggest it because it can cause acne because you locked the oil on your faces. So if you are too lazy to do that, just grab on your wet wipes tissue or wet wipes makeup removers. I just got my Miss Cousin's Baby Wet Wipes Makeup Remover and I'm just going to spread it all over my hands and my face. At five I wondered why people live and people die. And why the things I love just slowly So after I have a squeaky clean face I'm going to prep my face first With uh, this um, Skin Food Royal Honey Hydro Essence With um, Skin Food Royal Honey Hydro Cream This is the best moisturizer I've ever made It's amazing 2 to 3 pumps is enough Actually I just use 2 pumps and it's much Warm that between your hands and apply it all over your face and neck. Starlight, we are not alone. We're together on our own. And pack that a little bit to make it absorb faster. I said goodbye when I was ten to Santa Claus and all his Next I'm taking my Hydro cream, and I'm just gonna just a little bit of this when they and me God apply it all over your face and blend it. This BB cream already contains sunscreen, but if your BB or CC cream doesn't contain sunscreen, you can apply first the sun cream and apply this. So let's apply that all over your face and neck. I kept my mouth shut so I wouldn't rock the boat Because a kid who's fallen overboard is just too ashamed to float And still the stars remain the same So that's naked for the BB cream So next I'm going to take my concealer It's actually optional but if you have no kind of like imperfection or something like that, just lucky you just go straight and set it with your powder. I'm going to take my Giorgio Armani concealer, take it just a little amount and apply it first. Again. I learned to walk when I was one without a crutch to lean upon. I had to relearn everything. Let's set our BB and concealer. Because I want a really natural finished look and I don't want to get any cake in my face again I want to use a Giorgio Armani Loose Powder but you can actually wear your powder foundation or probably a sheer pressed powder The doctor says he's got a month or two to live He called to me there from his bed and with a weakening voice he said we are going to go to the eyebrows. It's it is optional if you have a really thick eyebrows. I actually have a really thick eyebrows, but I just want to shift it a little bit because I think it's a bit disappear after I use my BB and concealer. This journey may be pointless, but at least I sure can say you made it better for the rest of us. You passed along the way, still the star. So, um, I'm going to take my eyeshadow primer. You can either use the colored eyeshadow primer like I wear right now, but if don't, just use the normal eye primer that you got. If done, you can use any concealer. Taking my eyeshadow brush and I'm just gonna take it a little bit and I'm just a little bit as a wash all over my eyelid. So that's it for my eyes. Now I'm going to take a really 
dusty pink color so I'm taking this the, the, as the cold as they named it is a dust color from Urban Decay Naked Tree so I'm going to take a fluffy brush take it a little bit enough and apply that right on the ball of your eyes just in the middle of this Bows of evergreen. We find it is kind of like a toad color, really light toad color. I'm taking the same fluffy brush, take it a little bit, and apply that on your crease. Above your crease. On and on into the night till we start a snowball fight. So far, it's going to be like this. Top it below this one so you can still pick it off the blue metallic color but you can also see your eyes look much more bigger than before. Let's go inside it simmers on the stove weary dickens by the glow of the light that lingers through so after that I want to kind of like create more highlight on my faces so I'm taking this a bling bling eye stick from A to the house and just apply that on the inner corners of your eyes, on your brow bone, and where it's needed. But I'm going to apply that on the two parts of my Now you're grown in the city living on your own. I have here the Majolica Majorca. This is from Singapore, but I think it is Japanese or Korean brand. It is a brown mascara and it's really waterproof. It's a lush lightening mascara. So yeah, just like this one. And apply that on your top part and bottom part of your eyelashes. We would swoon Apply a powder illuminator like this Bobbi Brown Shimmer Brick Compact in rose. So delicious but so devious when you stole that kiss in So let's mix it now Now you're grown in the city living on your own But every snowfall I will think of you and Okay guys so I think this are for my final look And I'm going to top it off with a little bit of gloss. This is uh, Urban Decay Lip Junkie Colds and Pumps Lip Glosses. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments below if you have any requested on the video on the next spring tutorial videos let me know in the comments below thank you so much for watching don't forget to thumbs up this video and subscribe to my channel because i'm going to do a lot more videos after this so i'm 30 thank you and goodbye